Grey's Anatomy and Station 19 are back and they kicked off last week's season premiere with a big crossover event. And let's just say uh, it was an explosive premiere to say the least. Joining us now is Jason George who plays firefighter slash Dr. Ben Warren and Camilla Ludington who plays Dr. Joe Wilson. Good morning to you both. Hi, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I know. Uh, thank you for waking up early. I know it's an early call, but what a way to start things off. Uh, Station 19, you know, losing its main engine, staring up some old feelings of losing Captain Herrera. So, Jason, what was it like filming that scene? When we actually lost Captain Herrera? Yeah, when we lost him. And then also just going into the season premiere and just kind of bringing back those memories. It was uh, it was rough because you know we, we we you know you fall in love with your castmates uh, and you you become a family and so whenever anybody leaves it feels like and so it was kind of uh, and it, so watching the truck burn and his name on the back definitely you didn't have to you didn't have to dig too deep to find those emotions of like oh, I miss my man I miss my boy and so uh, that was a uh, you know I love that they found a way to keep tying that back in that you know when people leave the show, they're not just gone. Just like in real life, they come back up, you know, the emotions come back up at random times and we least expect it. And so there'll be even more of that as the season goes on. And I know we experienced that through Grey's Anatomy last season, bringing up people from the past. And for both shows, this is really set in a season in a post pandemic world. So how did the pandemic really change things on set for everyone? Well, I mean, our our safety protocols are very different, um, and, and Jason can attest to this too. We test three times a week. Our crew is in masks and shields. Still, we are still in masks until we shoot. Um, this is a lot of precautions taken so that we can continue to film and make the show. And to be honest, I you know there was a, I think a period of time where all of us wondered if we would be able to do it back in 2020 and so we're thankful that you know everything is is in place for us to continue making these episodes but it yes it's it's changed the behind the scenes quite a bit and camilla i want to jump in because we saw your character taking care of her new adopted daughter luna last week so tell us about this new path that she's taking and do you think uh, she'll find love again in the future yeah so we're this season we're going to really see joe um you know, with with Luna and being a new mom and juggling being a parent, and for Joe, she doesn't have family to lean on, like you know the sisters from Meredith, and she doesn't have a baby daddy that can help. So she's leaning on Link a little bit um, to give her some parenting advice and help her navigate it. And then, in terms of love, Jason's sick of me <laughs> saying it, but Joe Wilson is ready. People, I feel like <laughs> she's ready for love. Um, <laughs> I'm advocating for it. I haven't seen a script for it yet, but um, I think she's ready. I think she's ready. Well, I, I wish we had more time to really dive more into what's going to be going on throughout each shows this season. But before we go real fast, uh, I have to point this out because my producer pointed out to me, Teresa, but she saw a little online picture of you on Instagram with the hair all going crazy. I mean, your hair looks great today, but it's almost just like getting back into the norm a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, no, yes, Joe had cut it and found a hairbrush. Those were thankfully extensions. They were not my hair, thank God. <laughs> we didn't actually fry my hair. But yes, she will not be looking crazy for the rest of the season. That's the norm. I mean, we're doing these Zoom interviews. It, yeah, Jason did my hair this morning. It looks really good. <laughs> when I do it, it all comes together. Hair by Jason. Okay. I don't think it's be great. Yeah, he was here at 5 a.m. doing my hair. So well, we nice. appreciate the time and looking forward to seeing how these seasons play out. So thank you guys for joining us this morning. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, the drama never settles in Seattle, as you know. You can watch Station 19 and Grey's Anatomy Thursday nights at 8 and 9 p.m. and next day on Hulu. This week, though, due to our coverage of the Vegas Golden Knights preseason game tonight, you can watch it Saturday night beginning at 9.